Good morning. I'm Mary Ellen from the channel Mary Ellen After 60, and I'm here today to announce some winners to my last giveaway. And I think my last giveaway was my slacker ways, and I'll put a picture in here. I'm not going to be talking about any products. I, I'm just going to do a little bit of talking, if that's okay with you. Um, as you can tell when I showed you that thumbnail, my thumbnails, that's what you see when you get on YouTube. And they've changed the way that you make them. So I'm having a lot of trouble, but I'm working on it. The last giveaway that I did, that I announced five winners on, my, that, on that same video, I heard from everybody within less than two days. So everybody has their gifts, and I'm, I'm so glad that you watch. In the comment section of that video, all you needed to do to be to enter was just tell me something that you had learned this year and I tell you I was amazed at all the things you learned I was amazed to read about all your hardships in 2020 and your pain and the things that you were grateful for I saw a lot of gratitude in those comments and I appreciate them so now I have four winners to announce for $50 e-gift cards or a $50 deposit into your PayPal account. The first name that came up is M's Mom. Congratulations, M's Mom. The next name that came popped up was Hope to Know You 95. Congratulations, Darlene. The next name that came up was Cole Gal H, and I would imagine that means Colorado Gal H, but I'm not sure. But there's your comment, and congratulations. And the last winner is Pat Doss. Congratulations, Pat. Just leave a comment below, and I'll let you know how to get in touch with me, and then we can see if you want any e gift card or if you want um, a deposit to your PayPal. And if you live in a different country than the United States, I know we can figure something out. I wasn't going to film a video. I was just going to announce the winners. But I just wanted to share something with you. Anytime I film a video, I, I'm excited. I'm excited about what I want to talk about. And something happened in my life on the first day of 2020 that's kind of left me not too excited about things, but I know I will get back to it. I know I will. But my very best friend since birth died suddenly. She had died in her recliner, and her husband called me early the next morning and told me she was gone. My heart knows that God just picked her up and took her straight to heaven and that she is where we all eventually want to be. But I tell you, I've kind of been in shock. And I'm, I'm, I am, this is the second time I've tried to film it, so I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna be okay. But her name is Pat, and I'm gonna show you a picture of us together, of us together. You know, I say I don't do selfies. Well, last February, I'm glad I made an exception and took one of Pat and I together. Our mothers were best friends when they were pregnant with us. We literally grew up our whole 18 years that we lived at home within a stone's throw from each other. My mother would be on her front porch and Pat's mom would be on her front porch and they'd let us cross. There were two streets you had to cross, but the way our city blocks are, I mean, we could see each other's porch easily. We have remained friends, close friends throughout our lives. We got married within a month of each other. Uh, Pat this year would have been cel celebrating her 49th wedding anniversary. She stayed married to her first husband, which is something I didn't do, but we've been through it all. I would have a baby, she would have a baby. I would have a baby, she would have a baby. And then she had her third baby. We raised our children together. And no matter what, we've always lived within 15 miles from one another. I'm so thankful that I have no regrets that we remained close. I could talk about Pat forever. <laughs> I mean, we've been, there's been so many things. I mean, everything. But it really has hit me hard. So I'll be watching the people that I normally watch. I don't know when I will upload again, but I will upload again. There were several things I was planning on filming. I had a video already to film. 
just no way. I, my heart is not in it, but it will be. But I do know it is all good. I do know that. I know that I pray for her family. I pray for her friends. And um, just because we miss her so much. Appreciate you watching. And I'll be back. And um, don't know if I'll reply to comments. I don't know. It just depends. But I just need a little time. And uh, I will see you in my next video. Take care.